Hey everyone, welcome back. In this Excel tutorial, we are going to understand how you can quickly resize the columns within your Excel sheet. Now resizing is very simple and easy and most of you would be aware of it, but I'll cover some of the key aspects about the resizing of the columns. So if you see here, this particular sheet, you will see that this particular uh, column here is cut off, right? So discounted band, then unit sold, and then manufacturing price. So all of these are basically cut, right? And we can't see the details of these gross sales here as well so this is because of the resizing issue or the the value that is within these column doesn't fit with the size of these columns so to quickly resize the columns in excel you simply select all of that excel right so just click on this icon here the triangle right and then just hover over any of the columns that you see here right so as soon as this icon little icon with two arrows appear if you just double click it will resize all the columns perfectly automatically right with all the values depending on the length of the value the max length of the value that is there in any of these column in any of the rows you will see the columns has have been adjusted accordingly so that none of the value within these columns are being cut off and you can see the values perfectly fine right the other way is you would have already done it just hovering over the column say for example i want to resize this column b i'll simply change the size like this so i'll just hover over and i can press the left key of the mouse move right or move left accordingly right so if i want to reduce the size i i'll move left if i want to increase the size of the column i'll hover over press the left key of the mouse and move right in that particular excel sheet and the size of the column will be adjusted automatically okay the other way is so say, say for example i do not want to resize the whole columns there right so say for example i just want to select these two columns and resize them okay so simply select the two columns so from the top you just select uh, left click the mouse and select the two columns and just double click so hover over these this line here in between and double click so you'll see these two columns are now being resized according to the value that are there okay so let let me resize all of these and show you that other columns are not being affected because of the resize okay so let's say for example i want to resize this unit unit sold and manufacturing right so i'll just select those two columns hover over the mid of this these two column e and f and then double click so as soon as this icon appears i'll double click you'll see these two columns are being resized okay so this is how you will quickly resize the column in excel so that you can view the data properly and none of the data is being cut off um, the other important thing the first thing that we covered if you want to cover all the columns within the excel sheet and want to select all of those and resize simply select this triangle and then double click on any of the line between the columns and it will resize all the column perfectly fine all right so this is brief about how you can resize the columns within excel now the next thing i want to cover is about how you can hide and unhide columns okay so hiding and unhiding columns is very important because sometimes due to security reasons you do not want to print the or print all the details that are there in the excel sheet so what hiding will allow you to do is you can hide certain details say for example i do not want to print the manufacturing price when i share this data to some somebody in the team so i can simply just right click on this particular column okay and then you'll see that hide option appears so i can click on hide and this column will get hidden how you can identify whether there are hidden columns in the excel sheet you will see that the there are at the top if you notice clearly uh, there are two vertical lines here right in the column and this shows that there there is a hidden column right if i want to also hide the sale price i can simply right click and hide that so you will see the column color changes as well let me hide this as well and you will see there are multiple columns that are being hidden now to unhide these columns what you can do is you can either just hover over this vertical and then simply drag right okay you will see column h has been unhidden okay then again hover over drag again to the right g has been g is unhide now and then again hover over and you can see now that icon which was showing that there are some hidden columns has disappeared okay so you can see f g h all of the of them have been uh, are, are visible and not hidden if you want to hide multiple columns simply select 
the columns the number of columns that you want to hide and then right click and hide all of them together okay so you'll see all of those are being hidden to unhide all of them at once just hover over this icon the or or basically the hide vertical lines right click and unhide right so you'll see all of them have been automatically unhidden if you hide them say for example let's hide one by one okay and let's hide this one okay so now you'll see that there is a hidden column here and then there are a couple of hidden columns here so if i just hover over and hide a as well okay and let's see if all of them get unhidden at once so right click unhide you'll see it hides unhides one by one because we didn't select all of them together to hide okay so you have to unhide depending on the way you have hidden these columns okay so here if i select all three at once and hide and then hover over and right click and unhide then all of these will be unhidden so let me just hover over right click unhide somehow it is not yeah so you have to make sure whenever you are hovering over that this icon basically if you see closely notice that if you have to unhide then you will see the two vertical lines with the white spacing there but if you are moving a little bit further then there is a solid vertical line if you do that then it is not going to unhide that column so you have to make sure these two vertical lines with spaces appear when you are hovering over then right click and then unhide and that's how these columns will be unhidden right similarly if i move this here now there is a solid vertical line then in this case if i do unhide it is not going to work you just have to make sure that there is a vertical line with the spacing and then double click to unhide okay so this icon with the solid line is to expand and reduce the column size but if there are hidden columns okay then this vertical line with the spacing is required so that you can right click and unhide okay if i hide both of these b and c and hover over with these two vertical lines with spaces then double click it will automatically unhide those columns okay so pretty easy but you have to make sure that when you are hovering over you have to make sure that these icons what type of icon is appearing and which icon will be used to unhide the column and which one will be used to basically expand and reduce the size of the columns okay so that's all for this tutorial I hope it was helpful. Thank you very much for watching.